next. Groundling Marsh. Thursday on the Disney Channel movie, escape into a magical world. How far is it to the ivory tower? And enter a storybook land of make-believe. The never-ending story to the next chapter. Then it's a haunting tale that will raise your spirits. I'm dead, Zach. It doesn't get much worse than that, huh? When a friendly ghost... Good morning. ...returns from the grave to take care of unfinished business. I have to know what happened, and I need your help. It's a world television premiere. Susie Q. The Disney Channel movie, seven days a week, starting at 7 p.m. 6 Central. The following presentation has been closed captioned. Coming up next, welcome to Foo Corner, here on the Disney Channel. On the next Autobahn's Animal Adventures, get ready to go batty with the most misunderstood mammal on the planet, the bat. Find out what they eat, why they beat, and see why they love to hang around. You'll meet a real Batman, and this bat boy wonder who's a bat fanatic. And I saw these pictures of bats, and they're just wonderful. So whether you love them... She was affectionate and gentle. ...or could live without them... Gross. <laughs> ...you won't want to miss a single minute of Batmania on Autobahn's Animal Adventures, Sunday at 6.30, 5.30 Central on this bat channel, the Disney Channel. Top of spaghetti All covered with cheese I lost my homie When somebody sleeps It rolled off the table Here, and the Disney Channel's got some great treats in store for you. Brilliant idea! Oh. To get things going, Hundred Acre Wood is jumping with all your favorite pals in the new adventures of Winnie the Pooh. Cool! And it's time to swim with the fishes. Whoa! In the enchanted world of the Little Mermaid. This is going to be so 
much fun. Step through the looking glass with Alice for great adventures in Wonderland. Says who? Says me. And meet some new friends who live in Groundling Marsh. <laughs> and don't forget Iggy, Gloria, and Jacob. Yeah, that's right. You can find them under the umbrella tree. Catch the cutest, the cuddliest, the bravest heroes around, the Care Bears. There's some team I've got. And it's time to play with everyone's favorite kids. It's the Charlie Brown and Snoopy Show. And see one crazy duck have a quack attack. It's all happening right here, weekdays between 8 a.m. and 3 p.m. on the Disney Channel. The following presentation has been closed captioned. Coming up next, it's DuckTales, right here on the Disney Channel. Sunday on Amazing Animals. Hit the road, Jackrabbit, to find out where animals travel and why. They don't just migrate, they gyrate, they vibrate, and ew, look what that one ate. See how egrets get emotional. Hey! And swing with the stars of the jungle, the Gibbons. Well, this mouse gets out of a prickly situation, follow a pack of penguins, grinning gators looking for lunch, and see how wildebeest get stuck in traffic. In the wild, it's a whole new set of road rules. Sunday at 6 p.m. 5 central, it's Amazing Animals on the Disney Channel. Weekday mornings on the Disney Channel. That tells me one thing. Why? I don't care. That's why it's right there. It's where you'll find great cartoons. That a promise? Hey, kid, trust me. That's all we need to know. It's the only place you'll find Mickey's Mouse Tracks. Hello. 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 All right, all right, boys. Now we're going to play a little game. Tailspin. This is going to be fun. Come on, Baloo. I'm coming. Goof Troop. Chippendale Rescue Rangers. We're Rescue Rangers. We've got jobs to do. And I say we investigate. Weekday mornings on the Disney Channel. It's a miracle. It's a sure thing. Oh, baby, it's going to be too easy. It's all of that. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Weekday mornings on the Disney Channel. Are you sure this is a good idea? No, it's a great idea. And it's a great way to start your day. So as you're eating your breakfast, check us out. Weekdays starting at 6, 5 Central. And now, a special music break from Adventures in Wonderland. Even if the problem is they come in bunches, we like a person who can roll with the punches. Go with the flow, swim with the tide. Take on a challenge, accomplish with pride. You've got to roll. On the magical world of Disney. Where is it? It is filet of sea snake. Share the bounty of the sea with Captain Nemo. You got a king's ransom aboard here. And watch as the Nautilus goes to war. Collision speed. Then see a giant squid knock on the door. In a way cool trip, 20,000 leagues under the sea. Seen enough? On the magical world of Disney. Sunday at 7 p.m. 6 central. The following presentation has been closed captioned. because you don't want to miss what's coming up next on the Disney Channel.
one day, Mr. Brown decided to take everyone to the theater as a treat. And he reserved a box so that he could get them all in. Paddington had never been to the theater before, and he sniffed the air excitedly as he hurried on ahead of the others. It had a nice, warm smell, and everyone seemed very friendly and helpful. Would you like a program, sir? Yes, please, said Paddington. I'll have six, if I may. Thank you, sir. And will you be having coffee in the interval? Paddington licked his lips. Yes, please, he announced. I'll have six of those, too. Very good, sir. That'll be five pounds. Five pounds? Help! Oh, dear, Paddington, I think you've lost your marmalade sandwich. Look. Must you bring sandwiches to the theater? Asked Mr. Brown. You've only just had supper. It's all right, Mr. Brown. I've got some more in my suitcase. That, said Mr. Brown, is not what I meant. But Mr. Brown's words went unheeded as the curtain rose and they settled back to enjoy the show. The evening was a tribute to Cecile Bloom, the famous actor, who was performing pieces from his repertoire. The first item on the program was a piece of Victorian melodrama in which he played the villain. As far as Paddington could make out, the luckless heroine seemed to spend most of her time either tied to a railway line in the face of the 620 from Euston, or about to part company with herself in the local sawmill. He gave Cecile several hard stares through his opera glasses. But either he was too far away, or something happened as they passed through the lens, for they had little or no effect. Cecile was adamant. And despite the snow and the pleas from the heroine, it was clear from the expression on his face as the curtain came down that he felt he had won the day. Oh, dear, said Mrs. Brown. I do hope the second half is a bit more cheerful. I hope he's a bit better at remembering his lines, said Mr. Brown. He was making half of that up. It's readings from Shakespeare next. He's a famous playwright. Oh, gosh. Where's Paddington got to? Perhaps he's gone for an ice cream, said Jonathan. Perhaps, said Mrs. Bird, and then again, perhaps not. Knowing that bear, it's anyone's guess where he might be. Cecile Bloom looked at Paddington in amazement. Would you mind repeating that bear? He boomed. I've come to tell you to take back your daughter, exclaimed Paddington. It's snowing hard and she hasn't got a duffel coat. If you like, I expect Mr. and Mrs. Brown would take her in. I expect. Having delivered his ultimatum, Paddington waited for the storm to break. But to his surprise, Cecile, who had been looking very gloomy until then, suddenly brightened. My dear Bear, this is the nicest thing that's happened to me in years. The fact that you actually believe what you've just seen. To tell you the truth, I've been having a little trouble with me line. The prompter's been taken ill, and I suppose you wouldn't like to do me a favor, would you? Mr. Brown gazed at the slip of paper the usherette had given him. I have been given a very important job, signed Paddington. What can it mean? But the Browns didn't have long to wait for an answer. As the curtain went up, Cecilia began his famous recital from Hamlet. To be. Or not to be, Cecilie, called Paddington. Thank you, Baron. To be. Or not to be, Cecilie. That is the question. No, it isn't, whispered Mr. Brown. The question is, how does Paddington get away with it? That, said Mrs. Bird, is something even Shakespeare would find hard to answer. Coming up next, Care Bears. I'm depressed, Marta. 
I need an encouraging word to cheer me up. Well, pack up your troubles, because tonight you're all invited to Charlie Brown and Snoopy's birthday. The party begins with It's a Boy Named Charlie Brown. I think I need help. Then the celebration continues with Snoopy, man's best friend, followed by... Snoopy, come home! So don't forget to tell a friend and come to Charlie Brown and Snoopy's birthday. Everything I do makes me feel guilty. It's the Disney Channel movies seven nights a week, starting at 7, 6 Central. Saturday. They're cute. One, two, three, four, five new. They're cuddly. Don't ever feed him after midnight. But when they decide to party, you better get out of town. Gremlins. Then... Get into the Halloween spirit with two brothers who dream of creating a monster. You guys are insane. Burt Reynolds and Frankenstein and me. The Disney Channel movie, seven nights a week, starting at 7 p.m. 6 Central. The following presentation has been closed captioned. There's something special coming your way right here on the Disney Channel. is coming, said Spot. <laughs> is that it? Over there? Yes. That's the tent where the circus is, said Sally. Hurry, said the elephant. Did you see my ball go by? Asked Spot. It's green and blue and yellow and red. Green and blue and yellow and red, said the elephant. I don't think so. Ask the kangaroo. The kangaroo was on the trampoline. My ball, said Spot. No, it isn't, said the bear. Your ball's over there. There it is, said Spot. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, well caught, said Spot. That's a neat trick. It's easy, said the seal. Here, catch. <laughs> And again. Steady. There, you've got it. your hands as well. Circus, right here on the Disney Channel. Something new is brewing on the Disney Channel. This could really be the big one. It's the Disney Channel movie, seven nights a week at 7, 6 Central. Isn't that wonderful? Hang with the channel that brings you world television premiere movies and quality family films. Yeah. Now, seven nights a week at 7. You'll be begging for mercy. This month, you'll find adventure, Steven Spielberg style. I've never been so happy in my life. With the world television premiere of The Land Before Time and the U.S. premiere of An American Tale. Also from Steven Spielberg, come some seriously sick creatures. I'll bet every kid in America would like to have one of these. Gremlins. But we don't stop there, because this October, we've got more Disney Channel movies at 7. I love you, Susie Q. Like the world television premiere of Susie Q. The blockbuster hit Hocus Pocus, All Dogs Go to Heaven, Iron Will, and winner of two Academy Awards. I speak pig. Dr. Doolittle, the Disney Channel movie, seven nights a week, starting at 7, 6 Central. The following presentation has been closed captioned. Adventures in Wonderland, and it's only on the Disney Channel. On the magical world of Disney. Where is it? It's filet of sea snake. <laughs> Share the bounty of the sea with Captain Nemo. We got a king's ransom aboard here. And watch as the Nautilus goes to war. Collision speed. Then see a giant squid knock on the door. In a way cool trip, 20,000 leagues under the sea. Seen enough? On the magical world of Disney, Sunday at 7 p.m. 6 Central. I'm depressed, Marta. I need an encouraging word to cheer me up. Well, pack up your troubles, because tonight you're all invited to Charlie Brown and Snoopy's birthday. The party begins with It's a Boy Named Charlie Brown. I think I need help. Then the celebration continues with Snoopy, man's best friend, followed by... Snoopy, come home! So don't forget to tell a friend and come to Charlie Brown and Snoopy's birthday. Everything I do makes me feel guilty. It's the Disney Channel movies seven nights a week, starting at 7, 6 Central. On the next Autobahn's Animal Adventures, get ready to go batty with the most misunderstood mammal on the planet, the bat. Find out what they eat, why they beat, and see why they love to hang around. You'll meet a real Batman, and this bat boy wonder who's a bat fanatic. And I saw these pictures of bats, and they're just wonderful. So whether you love them, she was affectionate, gentle, or could live without them, gross. You won't want to miss a single minute of Batmania on Autobahn's Animal Adventures, Sunday at 6.30, 5.30 Central on this bat channel, the Disney Channel. <laughs> The following program is closed captioned. 
and has been recommended for viewing by the American Federation of Teachers and the National Education Association. Want to find out more about this show and other programs? Check out the Disney Channel online at www.disneychannel.com. Coming up next, Gummy Bears. After a hard day at school, get cool with the Disney Channel. Oh, goody, 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 goody. Beginning at 3, 2 Central, we've got cool movies. <laughs> what could be better? With different stories and different stars, five days a week. How cute. Give me some skin, Mama. Then there's cool tunes starring cool animals doing cool things that humans just can't do. I can't stand it, somebody. Uh, sorry, I get carried away. The Disney Channel brings you movies, 3, 2 Central, followed by tunes beginning at 5, 4 Central. Monday through Friday, that make your after school super cool. Yes, that should do nicely. Sunday on Amazing Animals. Hit the road, Jackrabbit, to find out where animals travel and why. They don't just migrate, they gyrate, they vibrate, and ew, look what that one ate. See how egrets get emotional. Hey! And swing with the stars of the jungle, the Gibbons. Well, this mouse gets out of a prickly situation. Follow a pack of penguins. Grinning gators looking for lunch. And see how wildebeest get stuck in traffic. In the wild, it's a whole new set of road rules. Sunday at 6 p.m. 5 Central, it's Amazing Animals on the Disney Channel. I need an encouraging word to cheer me up. Well, pack up your troubles because tonight you're all invited to Charlie Brown and Snoopy's birthday. The party begins with it's a boy named Charlie Brown. I think I need help. Then the celebration continues with Snoopy, man's best friend, followed by... Snoopy, come home! 
So don't forget to tell a friend and come to Charlie Brown and Snoopy's birthday. Everything I do makes me feel guilty. It's the Disney Channel movies seven nights a week, starting at 7, 6 Central. <laughs> The following presentation has been closed captioned. There's something special coming your way right here on the Disney Channel. Curious George, curious little monkey. Here he comes, he's always on the go. Curious George, the curious little monkey. Where's he going? We'd all like to know. Curious George gets a star. It was open school week, and the man with the yellow hat had come to school with George. I want to speak to your homeroom teacher, George, he said. Wait here in front of the art room, and don't get into trouble. George peeked through the door of the art room. Mr. Williams, the art teacher, was cleaning up. He had a big pile of brushes and paints, and was putting them in boxes where they would be safe until his next class. Hello, George. All the children in my art class will be coming with their parents to pick up the drawings they have done, he said. The walls of the art room were full of paintings. There were paintings of dancers and farmers and racing car drivers and ice skaters. Next to the blackboard was a long piece of paper with the names of all the children who had done the paintings. Some names had silver stars beside them and some had gold stars. Only one name had no star at all. It was Alice's name. Poor Alice, said Mr. Williams. I asked all the children to paint a picture of what they liked to do best. Alice said she left her painting on my desk, but I can't find it. Now I can't give her a star. Then he gave George some paints and a piece of paper. George sat down and started to paint his favorite things. Finish your painting, George, said Mr. Williams. I'll be back in a while. It's very warm today, and I want to straighten out the room before it gets too hot. And off he went. George kept painting, but it was getting hot. Mr. Williams was right. On the art supply table, there was a big fan. That would cool him off. He saw a switch by the blackboard, pushed it up, and... The fan started to spin fast. So fast that it blew Mr. Williams' papers all over the room. There went the paintings on the walls and all the gold and silver stars, too. George, cried Mr. Williams, running back into the room. Look at the mess you've made. Quickly, he turned off the fan. My papers and my stars are all over the room. You better help me clean up. Some papers were on the floor. Some were under Mr. Williams' desk. George crawled under there to get them. Stuck between the desk and the wall was a big piece of paper with a lot of dust on it. It looked as if it had been there for a long time. George pulled it out. It was a painting of a little girl riding a horse. That's Alice's missing drawing, cried Mr. Williams. Now I can give Alice a star. When the mess was cleaned up, George went out to find his friend, the man with the yellow hat. Soon, the children in the art class came with their parents. There was Alice's painting. George's painting was right beside it. Now, next to Alice's name, was a big gold star. Thank you for finding my painting, George, said Alice. I like your painting. You should have a gold star, too. I agree, said Mr. Williams, and he gave George a gold star. Then he waved goodbye to all the children. And he and the man with the yellow hat went home.
Coming up next, it's the Charlie Brown and Snoopy Show on the Disney Channel. When your school day ends, there's a Disney Channel movie waiting for you at home. Today, it's the Harlem Globetrotters on Gilligan's Island. And you won't believe how the island has changed. So don't be stranded. Hurry home to see Gilligan and the Ultimate Dream Team. Today at 3-2 Central, only on the Disney Channel. Thursday on the Disney Channel movie, escape into a magical world. How far is it to the Ivory Tower? And enter a storybook land of make-believe. The never-ending story to the next chapter. Then it's a haunting tale that will raise your spirits. I'm dead back. It doesn't get much worse than that, huh? When a friendly ghost... Good morning. ...returns from the grave to take care of unfinished business. I have to know what happened and I need your help. It's a world television premiere. Suzy Q. The Disney Channel movie seven days a week starting at 7 p.m. 6 central. Tuesday night, the king of the coop has lost his crown. He's a fake! But can he find stardom in the big city? Rock out with Rock-A-Doodle. Then go behind the scenes for a Walt Disney World celebration. The biggest party since the world began. An all-new Inside Out, Walt Disney World's 25th anniversary special. Two back-to-back -back events the whole family can enjoy. The Disney Channel movies, seven nights a week starting at 7, 6 central. Coming up next, it's Donald's Quack Attack on the Disney Channel. Monday, it's a journey back to a time when dinosaurs roamed the Earth. When a baby brontosaurus leads a search for survival. Great Valley. The world television premiere of Steven Spielberg's The Land Before Time. Then explore the mystery surrounding the existence of these great creatures in a dinosaur special that looks at their world. Dinosaurs, myths, and reality. Two back-to-back -back adventures the whole family can enjoy with the Disney Channel movie, seven nights a week, starting at 7, 6 Central. It's time for the Disney Channel Stay in Tune with Joe Baruso. Find out what inspires the producer of The Mighty Duck to get animated. Joe, who are The Mighty Ducks? Uh, the Mighty Ducks are a crime-fighting, hockey-playing team of ducks from another universe. Ducks! Which Mighty Duck is your favorite? Well, I think that has to be Nosedive. He's the coolest. On the ice, he's a left-wing offense, which I think is the coolest position. Ah, I think I just got the short end of the hockey stick. Here we see Nosedive on the ice. He skates up to the puck, and he prepares to take his slap shot. He says his dialogue, Lucy, I'm home, and then he fires his slap shot. Lucy! Draw any of this? Very little. Um, my job as producer and director is to oversee a team of artists who do all the artwork. The artists design everything that you read about in the script. A lot of artists spent a lot of time experimenting and developing and coming to a conclusion as far as the look of the show. From beginning to end, it takes approximately six months to create a 22-minute show, which is what you typically see on a Saturday morning mm -hmm. show. What's it like watching your characters come to life? There's nothing more exciting than giving a character a life, a personality, making him walk and talk just uh, out of your imagination. I'm only three and a half years old. Kids go up so fast these days. What advice would you give to aspiring animators? And most importantly, draw. Um, you need to draw every day. Um, you need to polish your skills as an artist. And possibly more important than drawing is observation. Um, you have to look at the things around you, the way that they move, the way people walk. A good animator is able to replicate and reproduce life as he sees it around him on paper. Mighty Ducks, a brand new animated series, Saturday mornings on ABC.
when your school day ends, there's a Disney Channel movie waiting for you at home. Today, it's the Harlem Globetrotters on Gilligan's Island. And you won't believe how the island has changed. So don't be stranded. Hurry home to see Gilligan and the Ultimate Dream Team. Today at 32 Central, only on the Disney Channel. The following presentation has been closed captioned. Coming up next, it's the new adventures of Winnie the Pooh, right here on the Disney Channel. When your school day ends, there's a Disney Channel movie waiting for you at home. Today, it's the Harlem Globetrotters on Gilligan's Island. And you won't believe how the island has changed. So don't be stranded. Hurry home to see Gilligan and the Ultimate Dream Team. Today at 32 Central, only on the Disney Channel. Friday, a Scooby-Doo Triple Freedom Triple Feature Friday. And the gang's taking on every kind of ghoul, ghost, and monster. First, Shaggy's teaching at a girl's finishing school. Scooby-Doo and the Ghoul School. Then it's ghosts. At your service! Scooby-Doo meets the Boo Brothers. And Dracula's bringing all his friends when Shaggy becomes a werewolf. Scooby-Doo and the Reluctant Werewolf. The Disney Channel movie, seven nights a week, starting at 7, 6 Central. The following presentation has been closed captioned. And enter a storybook land of make-believe. The never-ending story to the next chapter. Then it's a haunting tale that will raise your spirits. I'm dead back. It doesn't get much worse than that, huh? When a friendly ghost... Morning. ...returns from the grave to take care of unfinished business. I have to know what happened and I need your help. It's a world television premiere. Susie Q. The Disney Channel movie seven days a week starting at 7 p.m. 6 Central. They're the coolest kids on ice. Join the stars of the all-new Mighty Ducks Adventure. Go behind the scenes with D3, the Mighty Ducks, Thursday at 10.05, 9.05 Central. Coming up next, it's Tailspin right here on the Disney Channel. On the magical world of Disney. World it is filet of sea snake. <laughs> Share the bounty of the sea with Captain Nemo. We got a king's ransom aboard here. And watch as the Nautilus goes to war. Collision speed. Then see a giant squid knock on the door. In a way cool trip, 20,000 leagues under the sea. Seen enough? On the magical world of Disney, Sunday at 7 p.m. 6 Central. I'm depressed, Marta. I need an encouraging word to cheer me up. Well, pack up your troubles, because tonight you're all invited to Charlie Brown and Snoopy's birthday. The party begins with it's a boy named Charlie Brown. I think I need help. Then the celebration continues with Snoopy, man's best friend, followed by... Snoopy, come home! So don't forget to tell a friend and come to Charlie Brown and Snoopy's birthday. Everything I do makes me feel guilty. It's the Disney Channel movies seven nights a week, starting at 7, 6 Central. The following presentation has been closed captioned. Want to find out more about this show and other programs? Check out the Disney Channel online at www.disneychannel.com. Coming up next, it's DuckTales, right here on the Disney Channel. Sunday on Amazing Animals. Hit the road, Jackrabbit, to find out where animals travel and why. They don't just migrate, they gyrate, they vibrate, and ew, look what that one ate. See how egrets get emotional. Hey! And swing with the stars of the jungle, the Gibbons. Well, this mouse gets out of a prickly situation, follow a pack of penguins, grinning gators looking for lunch, and see how wildebeest get stuck in traffic. In the wild, it's a whole new set of road rules. Sunday at 6 p.m. 5 Central, it's Amazing Animals on the Disney Channel. I'm 
depressed, Marta. I need an encouraging word to cheer me up. Well, pack up your troubles, because tonight you're all invited to Charlie Brown and Snoopy's birthday. The party begins with it's a boy named Charlie Brown. I think I need help. Then the celebration continues with Snoopy, man's best friend, followed by... Snoopy, come home! So don't forget to tell a friend and come to Charlie Brown and Snoopy's birthday. Everything I do makes me feel guilty. It's the Disney Channel movies seven nights a week, starting at 7, 6 Central. Quack Attack is back, Jack! They're the coolest kids on ice. Yeah! Now, the stars of the all-new Mighty Ducks adventure. Kyle Neal. I'm Aaron Lord. I'm Keenan Thompson. And I'm Josh Jackson. Take you to the set. On the street. Ah! And with the pros for a total duck experience. Go behind the scenes with D3, the Mighty Ducks. Thursday at 10.05, 9.05 Central. Something new is brewing on the Disney Channel. This could really be the big one. It's the Disney Channel movie, seven nights a week at 7, 6 Central. Isn't that wonderful? Hang with the channel that brings you world television premiere movies and quality family films. Yeah. Now, seven nights a week at 7. You'll be begging for mercy. This month, you'll find adventure Steven Spielberg style. I've never been so happy in my life. With the world television premiere of The Land Before Time. And the U.S. premiere of An American Tale. Also from Steven Spielberg. Come some seriously sick creatures. I'll bet every kid in America would like to have one of these. Gremlins. But we don't stop there, because this October, we've got more Disney Channel movies at 7. I love you, Susie Q. Like the world television premiere of Susie Q. The blockbuster hit Hocus Pocus, All Dogs Go to Heaven, Iron Will, and... Winner of two Academy Awards. I speak pig. Dr. Doolittle, the Disney Channel movie, seven nights a week, starting at 7, 6 Central. On the magical world of Disney. World is full of sea snake. <laughs> Share the bounty of the sea with Captain Nemo. We got a king's ransom aboard here. And watch as the Nautilus goes to war. Collision speed. Then see a giant squid knock on the door. In a way cool trip, 20,000 leagues under the sea. Seen enough? On the magical world of Disney. Sunday at 7 p.m. 6 Central. Friday, a Scooby-Doo triple treat on Triple Feature Friday. And the... Oh.